I'm pretty sure it just crashed right there. <laughs> I just got down. The arrow is uh, broken off. Alrighty, guys, welcome back. Uh, just dropped off Peepaw at his spot. Uh, hopefully, he can get a doe down. Now we're going to the back side of the farm. We got we got a couple different bucks that uh, that I would shoot. Um, and with me being the intern for the Untamed and not being able to hunt a lot here, I'm definitely not going to be as picky as I would be if I had all fall to hunt. If something comes in that catches my eyes, I might just have to might just have to put him down. With that being said, I'm going to put this gate up. So yeah, like I was saying, I'm not gonna be that picky. Cause I don't have a lot of time to hunt this fall. So, whatever catches my eye, I'm gonna be shooting. This pot that we're going to, it should be pretty good. It got a bunch of acorn trees, so. I don't know, but I got my climber and everything back there. I'm gonna go climb a tree. Hope we kill one. No bug, really, whatever I see, I'll probably end up shooting. Like I was saying, we got a couple, we got a couple good deer on the property this year, so it should be good. I don't know, maybe not, but we'll see. to the cabin because we still got like another mile walk down the back side of this hill fingers crossed we can get it done this evening i'm feeling pretty confident because everything that people has been saying should be should be right on the money so i'm gonna get ready and head over the hill
Get it out, baby. I'm pretty sure it just crashed right there. Let the freaking go, baby. I just put a mint in my mouth. Okay. He wasn't that big. But I'm telling you right now. I don't have a lot of time to hunt this year. Because I'm working with the untamed. And he gave me a 20 yard shot right there. And I ain't passing him up. <laughs> I don't know how good I hit him, but I'm kind of nervous is a little low. But I think I heard him crash. But I don't want to get too excited right now. I'm going to go back and watch the footage real fast and get back up with y'all. Well, guys, I looked at the footage. I don't think it's as good as what I thought. I'm going to get down and go look for my arrow. So, I just got down. The arrow is uh, broken off. If you look, on one of my other arrows, I'm shooting 30 inch arrows. This is, there's probably, there's probably that much blood on it, on the arrow that's broken off. And probably, there's probably, shoot, probably four or five inches of the other arrow broke off inside of him. And there's some blood going up through here. So, I don't know. I think that we're going to give him time. I called people and uh, he said give it time. So, I think I'm going to walk to the top of the hill again and go get him and then give it about an hour or so and then come back down here and try to find him. First buck of the year. So, a little bit of buck fever, I guess you'd say. Alrighty guys, we're getting a four wheeler. And, uh, we're gonna try and take it halfway over the hill to hopefully find that buck laying there. People says it's dead, so I don't know. We'll see here in a couple seconds. You got Chris here to come help film the recovery. Yeah. How was how was your hunt this evening, Chris? Ah, uh, crazy. Was it? Yeah, I had 15 deer coming over my stand. It was pretty wild. Was it? How was your people? It was all right. Oh, was it? How many deer did you see? I saw none today. Oh, well, that's a bummer. Yeah, that's all right. I put my grandson in the best spot. He did. I think, I think he shot one. He did. He put me on. I will have to give him credit for that. Greatest me... guy in the world. <laughs> Let's go get it. That is right. He put me on it. Sure enough, he came through eating acorns. And hopefully I plugged him pretty well. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's go find this old joker. There he is, right there, boys. That's crazy. That's, you know, that's the bigger of the eight. But it's two about that size. I swear I never had no set in the picture. That's wild, isn't it? That's a good one. You got him? Mm-hmm. You, know, you shot him from the other side. Yep. Son, he's laying perfect for the picture. Now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's a good deer, isn't it? Oh, that's yeah. a great deer. Well, guys, we found him. How far do you think he ran? Mm, 75 yards. 75 yards. Yeah. And he I'm on my heel. That's what got me. Eating acorns. Yeah. <laughs> so, 
my first bow kill, my first ever buck with a bow. That's so. a good. You have a hard time copping that with the bow. <laughs> yeah. For a while. Right. So I mean, like I was telling you on the beginning of this video, I mean, I don't have that much time to hunt this fall with me being the intern for the Untamed and everything. So I got a couple of days off to come down here and visit family and stuff. And of course, you know, I had to, I had to hunt. Me and people had to, had to game plan in our heads to, uh, to split up and hunt. We knew that we were going to end up killing something tonight. Just didn't know when or what it was. I ended up shooting this little eight point. I'm tickled to death with him. Well, Couldn't be more happy. Oh got yeah, that, nine because uh, it got the big teardrop thing sticking down there. Right. That's three point three inches long, fool. So we're gonna get him gutted up and uh, haul him out of here, and I'll uh, I'll show y'all some more here in a minute. guys so we got him jug out hopefully some better lighting for you guys uh met up with Devin and then Chris obviously not a bad deer my first ever buck with a bow it took me long enough it took me 18 years to finally get one down he came in eating acorns on a little acorn flat a come a tree it was 26 yards Chris range finally yeah I'm, I'm pleased with it I done I killed a bear a couple couple weeks ago that video will be out around a little while uh, I'll explain more on that later but we got it done guys i didn't kill one last year but i killed one the year before so i couldn't be more happy with this deer i came in for a couple days and had enough time to get one on the ground that'll be it for this video i hope y'all liked it make sure to like comment and subscribe and share the video if y'all don't care and hopefully these guys can get it done while i'm up in west virginia we're trying to get some bucks on the ground but yeah We'll catch y'all on another video.